Hello everybody, welcome to another Grand Isle Gaming Unboxes. I'm your host, Grand Isle Gaming, and maybe somebody else will be with me, I don't know. But today we have with us the Nick Box Summer Block Party Mixtape Box. Basically this was, you know, supposed to be July's Nick Box, but it didn't come to us, it came to us in August. I know a couple of people got this early in San Diego Comic Con, so you know, lucky them. So maybe you've already seen this video before with somebody else, but I'm Grand Isle Gaming, I'm one of a kind. This is me. So here we go guys. We're just gonna get right into the meat and potatoes. Or in this case, whatever this box provides. Maybe this box has meat and potatoes. I don't know, you're pretty hungry. You're a hungry boy. Ooh, doo, 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 doo. Okay, that's a lot. That's a lot of stuff. Oh, hello, hello, hello. Okay. Wow, this is, this is actually pretty good. First off, we got ourselves a brand new shirt. God, I love these shirts. I love them whenever they do these shirts. Now this is actually from, um, this is from one of the Nickelodeon ads, I think from like what, the 80s in this case? Mid 80s I want to say? I think it's mid 80s. I want to say possibly, I'm not sure what year it is. Normally I know these, hmm? I know late 80s, but I mean like, I'm not sure which specific year. I think 88, 88 or 89, that's what I believe it is, but look at it, it's a nice little shirt. I wish what they had done was that they had like one of those specific shirts and it's like, it just spelled Nickelodeon and you'd have to find other people and you know, form yourselves around it. That would have been a cool little thing that the Nick Box did, you know, send out random shirts with like random little numbers and stuff like that. But that's that. Enough, enough history. Now you have this, your Arnold and Gerald um, tumbler thing. So you now you open it up. Okay, is there a straw that comes with it? Um, there is a straw. It's a blue straw. Nice. You know, I think I think I had one of these. Like what? Remember? But it was like the ghost emoji thing. But it got destroyed. But hey, th this is this will actually help, Josh. This is proper replacement. Then you got this spike. He's suffocating in here. It's our it's our dog. Spunky, you got some competition. Come here, dude. Get out of here. So there he is. This doesn't look too bad. This doesn't look bad at all. It's Spike. Ooh, that tail though. That tail is a little hard. Wish they did not put that fiber. These fibers in the tail. <coughs> I know I'm supposed to position it and all, but the fibers just like, like with how loose the this fabric is and the fibers within it. I don't know. They also got fibers in the ears. Jeez. Ugh. Uh, you, 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 you caught the ball, Spike. Good job. Good job, Spike. Good boy. Okay. So the next thing that we got here is the Arnold bobblehead. So, of course, all of this Hey Arnold stuff, it's supposed to promote the Jungle movie. If you guys saw on the Grand Isle Gaming Facebook, we actually posted, you know, like, hey, look, it's the San Diego Comic-Con trailer for... Hey, you're on the jungle movie, so of course they're gonna be having all this stuff. But here we go. This is um, the Nick Box exclusive TMNT collectible ice cream vinyl. It's just supposed to be an ice cream of uh, Raphael's head, just melted. You know, nice little thing to add to your collection. If maybe uh, maybe George World Tour has something like this. Oh no. Um, conglo it's a conglomo. Is this supposed to be a conglomo like beer holder? 
I know it's supposed to be a key. I know it's supposed to be a can holder, but I mean, I know it's supposed to be a can core and stuff like that, but you mostly see people hold beers and stuff like this. Someone's getting drunk with the magic meatball tonight. After that, we got these things. Um, they're little iReal Monster clips, chip clips. So basically, they're just little clips of, uh, of Ickis, Ublina, and Crom. I could definitely use this when I have to hold some papers together. So, you know, there's some practical, useful items here. I think this is probably the most practical Nick box set that we've gotten. Then you have the Gerald vase. I'm kind of afraid to open this up, but I but we kind of have to. Hold on. Uh. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Oh, oh, geez. So here it is. Here's the Gerald vase. It is just like you can hear that. Here. This is this is just glass, man. I have no idea. Like I thought it would like I saw some like some pictures of this on Tumblr. I honestly thought it was going to be a little bit bigger, probably the size of the box itself, so you could actually hold some real plants in here. I don't know what you could hold in here, though. I don't think you're supposed to, like, hold water in here. I think it's supposed to be, like, for those, um, like, those pencil, like, those pen plants and stuff like that, you know, like, those, like, those pens that kind of, like, look like flowers. I think you kind of just put them in there, or you could use it as a pencil holder. I couldn't, I couldn't see anyone using this for like actual plants or something like that. But yeah, also his skin is a lot darker than it is on the show. I, I don't know, it's just, it, that's just there, but Gerald has. Oh yeah, now this, this I can get behind. It's a Spongebob spatula and hat. Now I'm gonna try and uh, I'm gonna try try this, cause if yes, this is an actual spatula. You can see it. You can see the light reflecting off of this thing. This is a 100% genuine spatula. You can see it right there. This this is the real deal. SpongeBob's real spatula. I can't believe that they would actually, you know, give something like this out. I honestly can't believe it. That they would give out actual utensils. But, my God, you know, I'm definitely going to be doing that. I've got to make burgers more often. And then there's this. This is, um, okay, so it's supposed to kind of be like a hair thing. I have no idea how to put this thing on, but... At the end of the video, I will put it on. I'm going to put all this stuff on, and you'll be able to see all the official garb and stuff like that. So, but yes, there's a little Krusty Krab hat. My God, that's that's special. That was the that was the highlight of this thing. Oh, and speaking of the straw, here's the straw. So, I would just place that like that for now. Then you have this. What? Oh my, oh, what, oh, okay, 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 it's a beanbag toss thing, it's a beanbag toss game thing, it's a mini game in here, it's like one of those things you'd see like at a, like at a field day or something like that, you know, like you got it. You got three little, like, you got four little yellow bags here. You got four little green bags here. I'm guessing they're, they're trying to go for, like, Nickelodeon cars and stuff like that. Or maybe some double, double dare colors. That's what I can think of. But then after that, you have, like, these little stands here. And the little stands have these, like, little cartoon characters on it. You know, you just, like, you, you, you prop them up like that. And then... There you have it, your little cartoon characters and everything, and it's like, and then you just toss them in. Jeez, okay, okay, that, I was not expecting an entirely, 
like the entire game to go in here. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. If Grand Isle Gaming ever does any more videos, expect, expect a video like this to be coming up. Oh my god, that, that made my day. That really did. But, um, so, <laughs> now that I'm done freaking out over it, I'm gonna, you know, just flip over to the next clip and stuff like that, and then I will have all this stuff on, and then we will conclude the video. So, thank you guys. Okay guys, so I figured out how to finally put it on. It turns out that there's this neck strap thing, or this head strap thing, and you're supposed to just like put it around you, possibly behind the ears if you want, and then you kind of like balance your little hat. So there's that. Here's the official shirt. I'm ready for fry cooking, but all in all, that's the um, that's that's everything that's supposed to be for the Nick box and stuff like that. Expect some vi some more videos involving some Nick box related stuff like that, and you know, also you 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 guys know what I'm gonna say. If you liked what you heard or if you liked what you saw in this case, please be sure to subscribe to the YouTube channel. Be sure to you know do everything else like. Uh, I can't even think for real, guys. Um, go to the Twitter, follow on Twitter, follow on Tumblr. Donate to the Patreon because we need that more than ever. Also, be sure to check. Wow. Also, be sure to check me out on Ryan.com and all of that stuff. And I would end the video there, but there is one more important thing that I want to talk about here. It's that me and my family are kind of going through some financial troubles right now. We're going to be moving. So don't expect a lot of Grand Isle Gaming stuff for now. I'm kind of debating on whether I want to, you know, kind of end the YouTube channel. At least, like, or at least, you know, put it on another hiatus and stuff like that. I know it's not fair because... I was gone all July doing Camp NaNoWriMo, and now here I am back in August, and after that, all that just gets taken away. I understand that's a pretty big thing. It's a pretty bad thing, especially for new subscribers, or at least the 28 that actually, you know, subscribers that watch these videos. But, you know, there is a GoFundMe. It is down in the description. So if you really do, you know, appreciate what I do or like what I do around here, please just donate to that GoFundMe. Also give some money to the Patreon. The only thing is for the Patreon, that kind of helps with Grand Out Gaming related stuff, not with stuff related to the family. So until then, Grand Out Gaming, I only have a couple more videos on my post. The Million Dollar Stream is going to be there. The Slime video is going to be there. Basically... All, everything that I promised in my commercial, in my uh, ending one video, all that's gonna be there. I might not have, I might not do Pokemon Red at least for a while now, until I can find a proper time to you know do stuff like that. I might have to live stream it. I don't know, but so I don't even know what to actually say here. You know, so if you guys really want to. Donate to the GoFundMe if you really like what I do here. Um, if you appreciate it, then just go for it. I'm tired of saying the same stuff. So, this is Grand Owl Gaming, you know, possibly for a while now. Last time for a while, saying goodbye everyone and stay beautiful.